Hey guys, today I want to throw together a real quick tutorial on how to download songs from Artlist. This is not a super complex process, but sometimes you just need a little guidance and that's what I want to give you. So without further ado, let's hop right into the UI. Right when you log in, you'll be met with their home screen. Now, if you don't have an account with Artlist yet, it is a paid subscription royalty-free music service. They've got a bunch of different options for you to choose from for the plan that's right for you. And if you need any help with those, I also have another video I'll link in the description and in the cards somewhere up in here for you to check out and hopefully get a little bit of guidance on what you need. But if you know what you need and you just don't have Artlist yet, I have a link in the description below where you can get two free months added on to the end of your year's subscription. It's a pretty good deal and it also helps support me, the creator. Now, assuming you do have an account, we're logged in, we're looking at the main home screen here. You just wanna go up to the top here, you've got a couple of different options. You have music, sound effects, footage, templates, plugins, and apps. The music and sound effects are probably gonna be the ones that are available to you. These other ones, footage, templates, and plugins, those ones are for Artlist Max. Another video I'm gonna have is gonna outline all of the differences between the Max and the regular plans, but assuming you just want the regular plans, you're gonna have access to music and sound effects. So let's just check out the music and here we go. Right off the bat, you're met with some music options. Through here, you've got Maximum, The Last Hero, it's all going down. All of these are sorted by staff picks and that's up in the right hand corner over here. You can change this, change this to be sorted by top downloads. Um, you can adjust the vocals and instruments to just be just vocal or just instrument, female vocal, male vocal. There's a lot of options here, including BPM and duration. So that's the upper right um, sort of sorting UI. Now, over on the left, you're gonna have most of your browse features, something that you can add to tabs to narrow down your search, just to tailor things to the way that you want them. You're gonna see mood, video theme, genre, and instrument. Just checking out the mood, there's a lot of different moods. Same goes for video theme, genre, and instrument. But let's just say we're gonna be scoring a wedding video. A lot of people who use Artlist are wedding videographers, so. We'll go to video theme. I'm pretty sure they have one. Yep, right here, weddings. Boom, and all of a sudden you're met with a sorted arrangement of only songs that their staff has picked to be good or the artists have picked and tagged as good for weddings. Once you've decided on a song that you wanna use in your video, you can just slide over to the right side of that song and you'll see this option with the arrow pointing down to a line. That is the direct download option. Tap on that and you'll be given two options for the type of file you wanna download. I always use MP3, so just tap on MP3, and that'll be sent directly to your downloads folder in your PC or on your Mac. From there, all you have to do is grab that song from your downloads folder, drag it and drop it into your editing software, and you can go ahead and edit as normal. And I hope that this quick tutorial video has helped you out. If it did, I would always appreciate a like down below. If you want to have more tutorial videos like this and stay updated on news for royalty-free music content, you can go ahead and hit the subscribe button, and I'm just gonna keep posting stuff like that for you. That said, if you have any further questions, you can always just leave them in the comment section below. I will reply to you. We can have a talk about it and hopefully get things straightened out. Until next time, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.